At least one company's trying to give us games this year. <laughs> Thank you, Xbox. <laughs> What is going on, everybody? How are y'all doing? Before we get started with this video, you already know what it is. Give it a thumbs up, bro. It doesn't do any harm for you to just click that thumbs up right now. Do it. All right. Bro, we are getting some major news soon in like a week coming from nibble twitter user nibble and he has been spot on before and just the fact that he has given us a specific date it's happening boys it's happening he's tweeted out on twitter xbox series x games showcase May 7th, May 7th, we're going to get a G-A-M-E-S Games Showcase. We already got the hardware. We already got the specs. We already know when that Assassin's Creed Valhalla comes out. We're going to talk about that at the end of this video. The best place to play that game will be on this console you see behind me, bruh. That beast right here, 12 greater than 10. x gang. The hats are in the description. Buy one. All right. Um, but... What was I saying, bro? <laughs> yeah. Games. They're going to be focusing on games. The monkey Xbox has to get off their back this generation that they had last gen. First part exclusives. They've been hit or miss, bro. I'm playing Quantum Break right now. Straight fire. Sunset Overdrive. Straight fire. On the other hand, we did get a cancellation of Scalebound and a green light for Crackdown. So Microsoft has some work to do to regain the confidence in fans that, hey, our first party studio can still deliver bangers. Bro, y'all got rare, bro. When I tell you this, uh, in their Inside Xbox last year, that one game, Everwild, Everwild, I, every time I talk, I talk about that game, that game looks lit, bro. I'm trying to get the trailer up right now. Everwild, that game looks lit, and it's made by Rare, and so kudos to them. But y'all also got Banjo-Kazooie. If Microsoft gives us a 3D Banjo game, bro, you know what you could do with Banjo? Y'all could do what Nintendo do. Give us a 3D Banjo game. Um, go back to D Diddy Kong Racing was lit on the Nintendo 64. Better than Mario Kart 64. Made by Rare. Just put the Banjo characters, put this um, Diddy Kong with the airplane, hovercrafts, carts, bra. Y'all would have an instant banger. This is Everwild. This game looks lit. It's a multiplayer game. It looks like a Breath of the Wild type setting. Utilize Rare more than Sea of Thieves, bro. I tried Sea I'm done with Sea of Thieves, bro. <laughs> I keep trying to like the game. I don't like the game, bro. I was trying to sail. I sail right by the island. I had to run back downstairs to get the map. Look at the map. Man, I was done, bro. But, um... Um, <laughs> sidetrack so much, but um, the games, games, games. Xbox needs to deliver on the game front. Whatever happened to that game, Tunic, bro? Reveal that game too. There's so many games, man. Not just don't just give us y'all. Y'all gonna nail it. Halo Infinite is already looking lit. That game's gonna be lit. Hellblade: Senua Sacrifice. That game looks lit. Um, we know we're gonna get a, a, a new Forza game. We're gonna get. I'm not. I'm not worried about. We just need balance, bro. Um, uh, diversity in games going in. They've invested in 15 game studios, bro. They've invested in game studios, so they definitely, definitely, definitely have what it takes to compete 
um, um, this coming generation. And so May 7th, we still have some more news items to talk about in this video, but the big one is May 7th, Xbox Series X Game Showcase, according to Nibble, which has been reliable. Shout out to the homie Day Day for posting this in my Discord, gaming Discord. Um, my, hey, my sponsors be hooking me up with them. Scoops, bro. Shout out to East KY Retro. He be um, DM, DMing me scoops and, t and stuff too. But should be lit, man. I'm super hyped, bro. Super hyped for the Series X. Um, and it's going to be launching. When it launches, it's going to be more, more powerful than the majority of PCs on the market. Dudes keep saying, oh, the best version is going to be on PC. PC. And you still got a GT... Uh, GTI 600, some 600 series or something, bro. Come on, bro. Even the 980 Ti. That's what I got on my PC right now. But I don't game on my PC. Um, it's gonna be way. It's gonna blow that out the water, bro. And so um, we're gonna get have it on the hardware. We just need to make sure we have great software and a games. He specifically said a games showcase May 7th. This is coming fresh off the heels. Check, check out. <coughs> My last video, I talked about Nintendo. Nintendo is canceled their June Nintendo Direct. There's gonna not going to be a June Nintendo Direct. Now, it's still a rumor. It's still a rumor. I want to be very clear that it's a rumor, but it's coming from a very reliable source. Well, Nintendo canceled. And they, they are saying because of the COVID is difficult, but this is my thing, bro. That, that drought was before the COVID, um, the coronavirus. Um, I'm sure the coronavirus has affected them, but Xbox about to have a game showcase, bro. What y'all talking about, man? They hungry, bro. That's why I appreciate Xbox, even though now they're, that's why I like competition, man. They got knocked around last generation by Sony. They beat Sony last, the generation before, but they just messed up with the Kinect and, man. And so, come on, Xbox, get, get your swag back, bro. Speaking of Xbox, some more great xbox news xbox has just announced that xbox a couple of great huge milestones first xbox game pass has um passed more than 10 million subscribers that's crazy bro that's why i think next generation it isn't just going to be about hardware sales Microsoft is focusing on getting you into their ecosystem. They want gamer tag sales. They forget they could of course they want to still sell their hardware because that would help, but they want gamer tags, bro. They want to tag you. Um 10 million subscribers for Game Pass. That's crazy. I keep saying it, man. Game Pass is the best deal in gaming right now, bro. Street of Rage 4 just launched today. On the PlayStation, you got to buy the, the game. On Game Pass, it's included with my subscription. All of Microsoft's big first-party games will be included in your Game Pass subscription. That's crazy, bro. That's insane. Ori, Will of the Wisps, I didn't spend $60 for the game. It was in my Game Pass subscription. Probably the best 2D platformer this generation, bro. And so, good stuff to Microsoft, but that's not it. This is also something that's crazy. Xbox Live has nearly 90 million monthly active users. Think about this. The Xbox One has sold around 40 million this generation. But they have currently 90 million active users. They're, they're in the service business, bro. They're in the service business. Because PlayStation is at a, a, over 100 million um consoles playstation 4 consoles microsoft has 90 million active users meaning they don't really care too much i mean they still want to sell their hardware but they want those gamer tags bro pc they want you to um have a gamer tag on pc x cloud they want you to have a gamer they just want your gamer tag bro uh, so that you're into their ecosystem and so 90 million active users on xbox live um, Game Pass, 10 million subscribers, and Project X Cloud, they're saying, has hundreds of thousand active users in preview across seven countries. And so, Microsoft is setting themselves up. They've always, to, in my opinion, been ahead of the curve. With Xbox Live, 
when Sony and Nintendo wasn't even thinking about online gaming. They had Xbox Live. They were ahead of it. Now with this whole subscription model getting you into their ecosystem, Sony's starting to catch wind because they actually hired Microsoft to their to do their streaming services for next generation. But Microsoft is ahead of the curve, man. All right, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Oh, I got to talk about Assassin's Creed. The trailer was just launched. Fire, bro. And heavily advertised by Microsoft. At the end of the trailer, it said Xbox Series X. Even though it's a multi-platform game, Microsoft partnered with Ubisoft for this reveal trailer because you and I know which console will have the best version of Assassin's Creed. All right, dudes, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, <laughs> click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things gaming, bro. I meant to keep that Mario bro up. Come on, Nintendo. Get your stuff together. I mean, Animal Crossing is still killing it in sales. But it ain't for me. All right, we out. Deuces. You still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I gotta hook you up. That's right. I'm giving away a $60 digital code every month for your platform of choice. Xbox, Nintendo, or PlayStation. Two ways to enter. One, make sure you're subscribed to this fire. I saw Mario right Kart Double YouTube. Dash for the Two, follow me on Twitter at obi one plays and that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait, there's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming Discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash obi one plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later.